So you saw the recent video I did on detonation. If you didn't, I'll put a link in the description and at the end. But can you actually see detonation? When detonation happens, the air fuel mixture combusts at a random time in an unpredictable way and it can cause damage. So it's best avoided. But not everyone has access to tuning software or deck cans, although they're cheap and easy to make. I did a video on that. And quite a lot of the time, you're not um, in the car. For example, your car's on the dyno. During tuning on the dyno, your tuner will often take the car to the point where it's just starting to detonate. This is normal, all part of the process because finding that point where it starts to detonate is the point where it's where the engine's saying enough is enough, right? That's the power it's going to make. Incidentally, I always back off a little bit from there just to provide a safety margin for fuel quality, for temperatures, for, um, for components weakening slightly over the time. All things can go slightly out of calibration. So why is it useful to see detonation if your car is on the dyno and you're watching it it's quite nerve-wracking being able to see what's going on without necessarily having the the software or the login equipment it's quite useful so i've got an example for you this is an academy members hawkeye wrx that he was tuning with me sitting there with him guiding giving advice um hold his hand effectively while he was going through the mapping process and towards the end of that process we were starting to nudge up the, the power starting to nudge up the ignition timing until we heard detonation so run vt You might not have caught that. So I'll play it again in slow motion. Um, there was a small puff of smoke from the exhaust just at the point that we heard very clearly detonation on the deck cans. We both had deck cans on connected to the inlet manifold just to help us hear what's going on inside the engine. We heard detonation. You can see detonation from the exhaust. The ECU didn't hear a thing. This is a 32-bit ECU, Hawkeye WRX. Didn't hear a thing, didn't even see it. As it was part of the tuning process, it wasn't a problem. Tom just backed it off a little bit and we called it, called it done from there because you know, detonation through advancing ignition timing like that is just telling us, right, that's enough. Right, bring it back a little bit for safety. Jobs are good. So if your car's on the dyno, maybe not as the mapping process because your tuner will always try and find that point where the destination is happening. But if it's on the dyno for, a, let's say, a dyno day or just a power run, and you're seeing the, the puff of smoke out the exhaust, then that's a clear sign that there is a detonation event of some shape or form. It's worthwhile investigating. 
worthwhile finding out whether the, the map is unsafe or whether the fuel quality is, is poor or whether the fans in the dyno were not very good. Excess heat can cause detonation. Either way, it's worth investigating.